So as of now, Moneybag Yo and The Real Kyle Sister, these two are trending all over social media and people believe that these two are having trouble in paradise. <laughs> Now this all came about because two days ago Ari tweeted Niggas treat they homeboys like kings and treat they bitch so regular I'll never understand Never love someone so much that you ignore the truth about them And today she tweeted I always gotta pick up the pieces after somebody do me wrong That shit is not fair And then she says Pay back a bitch respectfully When you do good people wrong that it comes back on you i don't wish bad on nobody and i don't know nobody karma but i do know that it's real money bad randomly tweets the crazy part about shit is motherfuckers that talk to you every day will get on an app and express how they feel before they deal with it in real life ari also posted to her instagram story what's for me ain't gonna play me play with me or play about me if you date a bad bitch you gotta let her be bad. She also like this post right here. First, they give you butterflies, then mental trauma. Now, people believe that these two are going through some shit in their relationship. Do y'all agree or disagree? Now, I don't think you guys understand how smart and intelligent Moneybag Yo is. He is a marketing genius. I'm pretty sure they go through regular couple shit. But this is the same dude that faked the relationship with Meg and made millions off of that relationship. And whenever he was about to drop music, man did the same thing that Ari is doing right now. His baby mothers even did it. Am I saying he need clout? Hell no, he's one of the hardest rappers out right now. But whether it's good press or bad press, you gotta keep the people on their feet. And he just fed the fish bait. Now we got the lovely gentleman LeBron James in the office, and we got the WNBA star Cappy in the office. I ain't confused. I ain't on that shit that tried to kill me for real. I just can get out of that shit. I've been missing for almost like two years. I ain't even know where the fuck I was at. I do not want LeBron James. That nigga's a trafficker, my nigga. That nigga is a trafficker. He is a fucking trafficker. He traffic women in real time. Stole all my money out of my bank account. Now it has been said that Cappy has gone through a lot this past year, so my love, peace, and condolences goes to her. But unfortunately, she says she's been missing for two years. Off the basketball court, yes, but she has always been here. Her social media, her family, and her team proves that to be right. Now, some time ago, she was arrested, released, and after her release date, she went missing but was found. Now, according to her, LeBron James is a trafficker and he took money from her. Now, LeBron has never been accused of these type of allegations before, so some find it very hard to believe. Now, I'm just a reporter. I ain't really got too much to say on this. Y'all just let me know what y'all think in my comment section below. I love y'all. Please like this video when I'm out.